Hey everybody, as Tatacopia, and welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Birth by Sleep Final Mix. In the last part, we arrived at Deep Space and basically we met Stitch, and then Gantu had to show up, of course, and he thought we were like stowing away on the ship, but then we met the, met the Grand Councilwoman and we, you know, offered to help find Jumba and Stitch, and so we decided to look for Stitch, and we found his Wayfinder. And then we found Stitch, but of course he's left. Ah, oh, Stitch, why'd you leave me? <laughs> I'm sorry, I just love Stitch. And then we finally learned where Jabba and Bo Stitch are, so we decided to meet them. And then we did, but then Gantu had to show up, of course, and he had his own idea, you know, of capturing them. Basically, he just wants to kill them. I mean, damn, dude. I mean, Gantu is such an asshole to Stitch. I don't know why. I mean, he's such an asshole. I hate that. He sucks. <laughs> but thankfully, we managed to put him in his place. And it felt good. Because I really hate Gantu. So much. <laughs> and then we defeated Gantu. And then we became part of Stitch's, you know, circle of friendship. And yeah, that's basically what happened. And of course we all know that Ventus is next to arrive, and that's when Stitch finally escapes. And then goes to Hawaii? Or Earth? Or Radiant Garden? I don't know. Like I said last episode, they really don't explain where Stitch goes. We don't know. Well, wherever he is, I hope he's okay. Alright, so, now that we got that done... We're gonna move on to Neverland, and you know what that means, because once we finish off Neverland, then we get to the real good stuff. Can't wait. And as always, before we move on, I show you guys some stuff off screen. So let's see, um, okay, a new Keyblade, I know, not gonna change it whatsoever. Oh, here we go. So I upgraded the D-Link for Stitch. Uh, nothing else new for abilities or commands. Because I don't think there's any need to, you know, get any new abilities because I'm pretty sure I'm good. I mean, five magic haze? I mean, I should be pretty good. And, yeah, that's... Pretty sure that's all I've done on screen. Nothing much, really. Just same old, same old. Alright, now that we got that out of the way, let's move on. To Neverland we go. Over there! I'm gonna be the leader! Oh. Sorry. We're so close. Too bad, man. Tough break. But <laughs> yeah. No buts. You know the rules. The first one to find and claim the treasure map gets to be the leader. And that's you. Leader of the expedition. Uh, we're going on a treasure hunt. And that's our map you got. What do you mean? I never said girls can't be part of the gang. Come on, Tink. The more the merrier. I'm sorry, but I have something else I need to take care of. Here, you keep it. Too bad. But rules are rules. I guess we'll just have to call off the treasure hunt. No! Aw, come on, Aqua. All right, you win. I'll join you for one expedition. There you go. As far as I can tell, we're here. And this mark here is where we'll find the treasure. Well, that's pointing. Come on, let's go. Wait a second. We still don't even know our leader's name. I'm Peter Pan. The jealous one over here is Tinkerbell. And you are... Aqua. So you're Aqua. Huh? Now, first of 
first up, Mermaid Lagoon. Oh, okay. Oh. Well, I guess it does make sense, you know, Peter Pan knows Aqua since, you know, Ventus did tell him about his friends, Terran Aqua, so... I guess it makes sense. Which pretty sure, which means that Aqua is the last one to arrive here. We know of Terrapin first, then Ventus, and then finally Aqua. So it does make sense, you know, he does know Aqua. Whee! <laughs> Freaking love jumping on this thing. Oh yeah, so I hear there's something that you can do with this totem pole where I think if you hit it enough times or you hit in a certain spot, something happens, I think. I really don't know. I don't know if it's true or not that if you hit the totem pole, something happens. I mean, it's rumors I heard, but I don't know if it's true or not. Let's see, this is a map, right? Yep, the map. We need the map. Alright. Mermaid Lagoon should be. Nope, that's the Indian camp. Is that it? Nope, okay. Never mind. It's this way. Oh, there's a sticker. Oh, damn, this thing, too. the text you know I thought there was gonna be a text saying oh we can't go in there yet we're supposed to go to the mermaid lagoon ooh mind shield nice and elixir actually you know what here let's change Aroga to where's that mine holy crap I have so many cures damn how many do I have actually hold on let me sell some of the cures I have. I have, like, so many. Holy crap. 28? Really? Damn. Ho holy shit. <laughs> That's a lot. Oh, by the way, this is all from, like, you know, grinding. And, you know, the enemies drop off cures. Which explains why I have a lot. Look how much money I have. I have, like, tons. And also a lot of fires, too. Jeez. Uh, let's get rid of this. There we go. Alright, that should be good enough. Anything you need at the shop? Uh, nothing that I can see. Nothing new. All right, we should be good. Oh yeah, that sticker. Yeah. Oh, nope. I want to get the sticker. Sticker. I want the sticker. Yeah. Ah, I can't reach it yet. Ow! Oh, hey, hey, hey! Would you leave me alone? I'm trying to get a sticker here. There you go. I 
have you now, Peter Pan. Today's the day I shall be rid of you forever. I'm busy right now, Hook. We're on an expedition. Can't I show you up some other day? You show me up now. Give back me treasure. Who's that? Ah, oh, that's just Captain Hook. He's a two-bit pirate codfish. I'll cleave you into two bits, boy. It's me. Oh, that was the captain's signal. Fire! We're sitting ducks out here. Run! Oh, great. Now we have to deal with cannonballs, too. <laughs> Fantastic. As if we didn't have enough problems already. Holy sh- ow. God. Thunder. But at least it damages the inverse, too, I believe. Do the cannibals hurt the inverse? I think so. Hold on. Before we go, I know there's some chests I want to get. Where are they? Well, here's one. Elixir. Don't need, but I'll keep it. Uh, and of course, there's always this chest that's hidden. Ooh! Faraga Burst. Hello? Hold on. Oh, I know this one. Ah, oh, Faraga Burst, yes. Okay, this one is very... Very nice magic, you know, command. What does it do? Well, I'll show you. Here in first, I got something I want to show you. Here we go. Oh yeah, there we go. You see that? Um, you be sure I'm going to keep, you know, frog first because it's very powerful. And unfortunately, it takes two slots, but I'll keep it. Way? Nope, okay, never mind. I thought I'd go that way, but I guess we have to go this way. Fire. So, what's been going on for me lately? Well, nothing much. Except for I'll give you a guess. Am I excited about? Well, I said it last video, but in case you don't know, the new Star Wars movie is coming up tomorrow. That's right. Rogue One. Or actually, is it already? Well, I actually did that on previews, but yeah, I'm going to watch the movie tomorrow, guys. It's... Oh, I can't wait to see it. It's gonna be amazing. In case you don't know, I'm a huge Star Wars fan, and you should be too. Oh man, but this movie, I'm pretty sure it's going to be so hype. Could be a lot of action, a lot of fights, space battles. Even has Darth Vader in it. I mean, what more can you ask for, huh? Oh, I can't wait to see it. It's going to be amazing. Oh, it's going to be so exciting. And you'll be sure, maybe I'll talk about it, the movie next episode when I watch it. Give you guys my view, see if it's a good movie or not. What is it? The mark on the map points all the way up there. Ah, oh, relax. A little pixie dust and we'll be there in a jiffy. 
But we've never had to fly that high before. What if we fall? Hey, when did you two turn into cowards? Don't you think you're asking a bit much of them? This is between me and them, Aqua. Men, only the bravest of the brave can claim that treasure. Yeah, we know. Tink, if you would. We haven't got all day. Here we go! <laughs> Does that mean we can fly now? Like them? Oh. I guess we can't. Okay, so I guess they're flying while we have these balls of light. Seems a bit weird, but... Eh. Actually, no, it's not weird. What am I talking about? Sorry. I keep on saying stuff is weird all the time. I gotta stop saying that. It's not weird, okay? It's just a game mechanic, okay? It's not... I mean, if there was a cutscene, like... We would have shown Aqua, like, flying, like, in the Lost Boys, but... I guess this is fine. It's not weird. It's pretty fun. But yeah, I gotta stop saying weird stuff, like... This is so weird, or... Doesn't make sense, you know? I mean, it's Kingdom Hearts. Oh god. Get off. Go away. Freeze. Die. Thank you. I think this is the way to go. So let me go the other way first because I think there's some chests over there. Oh, oh no! I fell! Ah. Nope, I have no time for you. So remember when I fell there like a second ago? So apparently, I guess with Kingdom Hearts 3, is that when you fall down, there isn't supposed to be any loading screens from what I've heard. Just because, you know, the world is so massive, I'm pretty sure there's no need for a loading screen, you know? I mean, that sounds kind of cool, you know, like, no loading screen to deal with when you fall down. Because the world is so big, and I just can't wait to see the world, what they look like. And I think the world to Kingdom Hearts 3 might take an hour to finish, I think. But I've heard also, I'm not really sure it's confirmed, that, you know, the world length is like an hour or something. I'm not really sure. I mean, it would be nice, because that would mean Kingdom Hearts 3 would be, like, the longest game out of the whole series. And, you know, considering the fact, you know, there are going to be more worlds in Kingdom Hearts 3 than Kingdom Hearts 2 had, so... I mean, it lets you know that Kingdom Hearts 3 is going to be a huge game. Hey, aren't we back where we started? You mean we went all the way around Neverland for nothing? 
Well, you conquered all sorts of obstacles to get here. And to me, that's certainly not nothing. You know, I had you all wrong. You were just looking out for them back there. Being a good leader. Yeah, of course I was. You're too late, Peter mm -hmm. Pan! I'll be taking what's mine now! It's Hook! It's me. Secure me treasure. Aye, aye, Captain. Ah! What is it now? <laughs> Captain, it's the treasure. It's been... Spit it out, you idiot! Hot fish! It's all junk! What do you mean, junk? Those are our treasures, Hook. But what did you do with my treasure? Oh, we lost at it all. <laughs> you what? You scurvy brats have crossed me for the last time. Oh. Hmm? What's that? That sound. Tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Not you again. No, get away from me. Smee, do something. Smee. Wait, Captain. <laughs> Is this? Oh, Ventus left that here. I guess it's a special keepsake or something. But don't worry about him. He said he would be all right without it. And then he promised to visit us again with even better treasures. Maybe enough to fill a hundred treasure chests. Then he was here, <laughs> and someone else. What's the matter? It's nothing. Best that you stay here. Uh oh. Whatever Aqua senses is can't be good. Oh, <gasps> double flight. Ooh, use double flight to jump twice for extra height. Oh, I'm equipping that. And that means I can finally get that sticker I was trying to get. Alright, hold on. Let me see. Equip. There it is. Double flight. Look at that. Whee! Extra boost. Cool. Alright, let's see. Um... Should I change anything? Let's see. Uh, prism ray, I'm probably gonna keep. Uh, finish commands. Teleport spike. Uh, <laughs> spike. I don't know why I have a hard time saying that word. I keep saying strike, tyke, it's spike. I mean. <laughs> uh, I think we're pretty good. And, unfortunately, guys, I think I might end it right here because I'll say it right here is that we're facing a boss fight, and once we beat the world, Neverland, we're going to get to more story, and, you know, that makes the video even longer, so I would keep going, but, like I said, like, this, if we beat, you know, this boss, we finish Neverland, there's, like, more cutscenes to see, and... Actually, wait, hold on. Yeah. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. So, I'm gonna cut it right here, guys. Like I said, I explained to you why I'm gonna cut it right here. Yeah, this... Yeah, I'm gonna cut it right here. Seems like a good time to do it. I apologize if you want I mean, you know, see the boss of this world, but... Okay, I gotta stop explaining, okay? Like I said, I've explained to you guys lots of time, and I keep saying it again. I'm sorry. Okay, so, I'm ending right here, guys. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, be sure to leave a like and comment. And, next time, like I keep saying over and over again, we're gonna face the boss, and then, once we beat the boss, then we're gonna get even more story. So, yeah. Also, by the way, I hope you guys are going to, like, I hope you guys 
enjoyed the Rogue One Star Wars movie. And if you have seen already, let me know in the comment section, but don't put any spoilers. Just tell me if the movie's good or not, if you have seen it. If not, well, I hope you guys enjoy the movie tomorrow, if you guys are, because me and my friend, we're gonna watch the movie tomorrow. It's gonna be awesome. Can't wait, it's gonna be amazing. I'm just so excited, guys. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm just too excited. So anyway, guys, it's been Hesitator Cobra here, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. See ya.